Hello, this is a guide on how to make trading shops in this Minecraft server. First and foremost, trading shops are used to just trade between players. Think of like a normal village here. You put in an item and it'll give you another item. For example, you can put in this piece of dirt and you can get out a dirt path. To get a shopkeeper egg, what you gotta do is either just spawn in to the server for the first time or type in slash warp spawn. It'll bring you to the spawn of the server. On the left side, you'll see a villager named Shopkeeper Eggs. If you go up to it, you'll find that the Shopkeeper Eggs cost 10 iron. So you buy one and then you can go run off and make your shop. As you can see, it puts a little bit of instructions in the chat for you. We'll get to that in a little bit. Let's say we want to make a shop right here. First and foremost, put down your chest nearby where you're going to be putting the villager. Then, pull the egg out into your hand, and use left and right click to cycle through the different shop types. The players in the server will be restricted to only using the trading shop. However, if you want to use this for any purpose, you, you can use the bookshop, sell shop, buy shop, or the trading shop. Now what you gotta do, right click with the egg onto the chest, then right click where you want to put it. Let's say I want to put it right there. So chest is right there, villager right there. No one will be able to hurt the villager or move it around. The villager will look around though. It'll look at the nearest player. So first what you gotta do, you can either, you could put this chest underground if you wanted to, because you can access the, the chest inventory from here, or if you crouch and right click on the shopkeeper, you can view the shop's inventory from there. So let's say I wanted to put this dirt path in there. That's the thing I want to buy. And this is what I'm trying to buy it with. So this you keep in your inventory. This is what the thing you're trying to buy you put in the chest or in the inventory. Bruh. Uh, next up, you just shift and right click on the villager again. Then you see that the dirt path is in there. Since you're trying to buy it with the dirt, you put the dirt right underneath it. And now you can adjust how much dirt that uh, you need to buy the path. So you left click to bring the value up and you right click to bring it down. If it's already at one and you right click again, it'll just get rid of it. So you just put the dirt in. And boom. Now, if you right click on the shop, you'll see that it's asking one dirt for one dirt path. So you put in the dirt, you get the dirt path out. And now you see it's X out, it means it, it has no more. The owner of it, you will have to resupply it. So now I can go here and it gives me the dirt because I'm the owner, so I would be receiving the payment or the trade. So again, let's say you want to you want to trade the dirt path for the dirt go back over you put the dirt in and then you put the dirt path in put the dirt and boom now you can buy the dirt with the dirt path and again i'll be getting that back but that is oh and so if you go through the settings so you can turn off the trade notifications the one that i've been getting here uh you can turn into a baby you can change the profession you can change the type of villager like which biome uh badge color that's only for select Villages like down here, it'll have that badge that you can change. Again, shop inventory. Uh, this tells you what type of shop it is. Uh, pages for if you have like multiple pages of items. Uh, here's to delete the shop, and then you can set the shop name. So you click on that, then type in chat. You could do um dirt shop. So now it'll be known as the dirt shop. And again, you can increase the amount and whatnot. 
And then finally, you can delete it. Yes or no? Yes. You do not get the egg back, though. But you get all of your items back. And that is how you make a trading shop.